metamask gas fee setting 2022 hello guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing amazing so in today's video i'm going to show you about the metamask advanced settings and gas fee settings so first of all what you have to do is you have to open metamask.io on your web browser and this is the site that will be welcome to and here as you can see a crypto wallet and gateway to blockchain app so metamask is basically a crypto wallet there are also many other uh, websites or many other wallets that you can use but the good thing about metamask is it allows a lot of stuff for free which uh, you know other wallets uh, you know charge you for and it comes as a google extension so it is very easy to use with other uh, nft platforms or you know uh, into the signing in of uh, your other platforms it is very easy to use uh, metamask and it has a lot of settings that we will explore in this video so first of all what you have to do is after opening the website just you know scroll down and see it has a lot of options buy store ascend swap tokens uh, you can also come here blockchain apps and get started and what is metamask metamask you can you know view this video for a quick overview of what is metamask and how you can use it and your key to blockchain applications and etc etc so this is feature support about build and you know uh, you can also change the mode to your night mode if you want to so first of all what you have to do is you have to click on this download button and it will ask you if you want it for chrome or ios or android so as i'm using chrome right now i'm just you know install metamask for chrome it will open up another you know metamask chrome web store and metamask extensions it will open up the chrome web store and you know you you will be redirected to extension so this is uh what it's showing me uh, i have metamask already downloaded in my google and i also have it as an extension already so this is uh, asking me if i want to remove uh, from chrome or if i want to remove this you know if i want to remove this extension so uh, where does this extension appear here you can see this is a small icon if you just you know uh, click it here you can see your extensions so this is metamask this it has an icon of a fox fox shape like this one it's a very smaller version of that so this is metamask if you just you know pin it to your bar then you can see your metamask extension right here so if you click this your metamask extension right here so after signing in and creating your own account this is the metamask homepage. like this is your own wallet and here as it shows your ethereum because i don't have any funds or any money in my account right now so what you want to do here is this is you know you just uh, you can do a lot of stuff i'll just go uh, make you go through all the settings here but first of all you have to know that metamask come as an extension extension here it is this is the extension of metamask on your google chrome so whenever you visit different sites or you know those unknown sites they can see your you know they can see the information about your metamask wallet or your crypto wallet so just make sure that your uh you know information is well secured and that's why metamask has added another step of securing your account or securing your profile where you can add an uh, additional password to your account so that your information is secured it is a crucial step you can add it uh, anytime and you once you go into the settings so as you can see here here's an option too where you can buy different you know uh, deposit ethereum into your account this is where you can buy uh, you know buy your ethereum or your cryptocurrency and it has you know shown you different platforms it has given you different platforms and from here you can send your uh, currency to someone who you want to send it to and you just need their public address and your you know their complete address so that you can send your you know ethereum to their account and from here you can swap your currency like if you want to change your your ethereum to you know polygon you can enable smart transactions you can uh, simply do that if i want to change my ethereum to polygon if i want to swap my currency so that i can do that uh, like there's a lot of options that it has it has usdd jasmine bet mana like there are a lot of options and you can change it to any option that you want to so there is uh, a lot of other stuff that you can do on metamask now as well like about the gas fees if i if we talk about the gas fees if i want to send someone you know some different uh, some currency if i want to send someone ethereum or some you know currency from my account to theirs i need their account address and something so for that i'm just using my copied my own account address right here and i want to go into this option so uh, send to and if i paste my own account here then you you'll see that it says insufficient funds because i don't have any funds right now so obviously i cannot send anything to another person but if i had funds in my account here then they will show me gas fees this gas fees is basically like transaction fees or the fees that you have to pay additional amount that you have to pay once if you are transferring funds to someone else's account so uh, gas fees changes every day like uh, it uh, depends upon different nfts it depends upon the market price it depends upon the marketplace what's going on and uh, you know the what's hurling in the market and it depends upon that so it changes every day it varies every day so you cannot have any uh, you know specific gas fees anytime uh, it can be something right now and it can be a dollar 
dollar up or dollar down the other day it can you know vary like that so this is about the gas fees it's always good to have some extra you know ethereum or extra dollars in your account for, for the transactions to made because of the gas fees and you do not know how much the gas fees is so it's good that you have a hundred extra dollar in your account so that how much is your gas fees you can be easily you know paid or there won't be any problem with your transactions so about advanced settings you just you know come here to your profile and here you can see there is an option of setting and if you go into that these are the general settings your currency conversion us dollars you know and your primary currency is ethereum uh, you know your language is english and uh, account identification is jazzicons and you can also you know make it to blockies if i want to i can and hide tokens without balance and you have you know uh, i have uh, you know off the setting as uh, for you know setting is off and here you can see there are advanced settings if you come here you can see the state logs you know sync with mobile uh, this is option is now available you can sync your account with mobile and uh, it's very easy and if you want to you know remove all the history of your transactions you can you know just uh, reset your account and it will surely delete everything every data that you have in your account all your transaction history and etc this is a very quick way to remove all your history and all your transaction history so that if you there is some problem with your account or if there is you know something or someone has got a hold of your account you can just simply come here and reset your account and they won't have any information about it so then other is advanced gas control if you turn this setting on this is uh, this show gas price and limit controls directly on the send and confirm screens this will show you how much gas fees you are paying for each transaction directly on your screen when you are making the transaction so this is this was setting was not available on metamask before but this is now in 2022 and this is enhanced token de detection you can also turn this on this is show hex data this select this to show the hex data field on the send screen you can also see the hex data on your send screen show a uh, conversion on test networks if you want to you know select this to show fiat conversion on test network you can also show the test networks auto lock timer if you want to you know set the idle time in minutes before metamask will become locked if you want you know if you're using your computer just uh, you know randomly and uh, you just have to go somewhere immediately if you have turned this lock timer it will lock your metamask in say one minute or two minutes or three minutes of inactivity and this is a very good option to uh, you know secure your account from anything which is out of the place or if you are not available or if you're not using your uh, laptop or someone else is using your laptop if you want to back up your data you can if you want to restore your data you can you can also sync your data with three box it is experimental you can also have an ipfs gateway and this is how you this is all the settings that you know use these are all the advanced settings that have added into metamask and which is you know really credible and which are really increasing the proficiency of metamask because it is allowing a lot of things that other wallets are not allowing you for free so if you come here you can add your build your contact list and for security and privacy they have a reveal secret recovery phase if you add this your account will be more secure than it ever was and if you want to show incoming transactions this is on use phishing um phishing detection this is also on and if you want to add alerts now this is very important if uh, browsing a website with an unconnected account selected I, th I have you know on these both of these alerts this is very important when you are you know just browsing randomly and if a website tries to use the removed window if a website tries to use the information of your metamask or crypto uh, wallet the, then you will suddenly be alerted about it and if you want to add more different network then you can uh, surely can like here uh, you can see this is ethereum manet this is the url this is the uh, chain id and this is currency symbol and this is the ethereum manet that i have already added if you want to add a new uh, network then you can surely can here this is a network name you can add in the url chain id currency symbol and you can add just save it and the network will be added so the next one is experimental and uh, you can see that the metamask has a lot of options if you go just go back here so what you can do else here is uh, you can add more you can you know you can add tokens to your uh, metamask if you want to add tokens you can just uh, click here into the import tokens and you can search to some tokens if you want to make a custom token that you can uh, add a token contact address token symbol token decimal that you can create your own token or import your own token into your metamask wallet and here you can see there is a list of networks uh, if you, i don't have any network right now added so if you do you will have you will see the list of networks here and you can simply you know switch from ethereum mana to any other network that you want to and uh, this is e how easy it is this is how easy it is to use metamask these days and another good thing about metamask is you can uh, sign into any nft uh, website using metamask very easily like i'll show you very quickly there is one that i usually use that which is openc.io it is a very good website for selling and you know 
buying your nfts if you want to sell your nft art it is an amazing website for you if you want to buy some nfts this is also a good if you're a collector of nfts this is amazing so this is what the website looks like and if you come here is a small you know icon which is a wallet tape so if you click this it will uh you know have you connected to your own wallet so i have a metamask wallet i will just click on this option and there is a simple um notification or a simple you know pop-up will appear and this will redirect you to your metamask account and this is how you can you know connect your metamask account your metamask wallet to your open c it is very important to have a you know crypto wallet to access any nft platform so having a metamask because it comes as an extension it is it makes it a hell lot of easier because you can just come here you can connect it and you can just can see connect in and that's how my wallet is uh, you know my wallet will be connected to my this website and i will be signed in or logged in and i can use it or for selling or you know for buying or anything whatever and welcome to open c uh, i will just you know accept and sign the privacy policy and everything uh the terms and services and this again the pop-up will open and here it will ask me to sign the transaction or sign the uh, login and i will just do that and that's how i will be logged in into the open c and now i can access the whole website all the features of the website and there won't be any problem in that with me so here is my wallet my total balance is 0.00 us dollars because i don't have any funds right now in my wallet but this is how easily my wallet has been connected to open seas and this is why metamask is good it is an extension you can use it anywhere and it is very easy and very accessible and it has a lot of features and you know um it is not less in any way from any other wallet that you might use you know a crypto wallet that you might use for any uh, kind of you know transactions or anything but this is amazing and this is as you can see that i've all logged in so i can access anything that i want to if i want to buy something if i want to uh, sell something i can you know uh, my wallet will be already connected to it so if a person tra transfers money into my wallet my if a person wants to buy my nft they will uh, transfer the money directly into my wallet so this is how easy it was these are all the advanced settings of metamark that it is offering in 2022 all the advanced settings and about the gas fees and everything i hope you enjoyed this video and how i hope it was informational for you and for more content like that please like share and subscribe my channel and keep watching until the next video take care bye bye